I had out here when I had a guy who come down and I had already done, done two rounds that day and the carry master asked me to go again on another round and I wasn't too keen on it. And how, how old were you at this time? Oh, I was back in the 74s. So I'd be, I think I would be coming up 28, somewhere around there. All right. But anyway, he came onto the tee and he was dressed in plus fours, nice new hat <laughs> and everything. And he said, uh, what's the line? I give him a line off the tee. And he hit the ball on the tee and then turned to me and he said, Jimmy, will you go and get the ball? <laughs> so I was kind of amazed at that. So I walked down off the course, down to the side, back onto the course, got the ball, come back off the course, walk back up, come down back to the first tee, and handed him the golf ball. And he says, thank you, Jimmy. He says, where can we go for a beer? So at that time, the 19th hole was just across where the RNA shop is, across it, the old course shop. So he goes in there and he starts buying me a couple of beers and then wines and dines me. He says, I owe you a fee, don't I? I said, yes. So he <laughs> paid me and then paid me a tip on top. And then asked me, he says, I've got my scorecard here. And he says, Jimmy, how far was the ball over the road? And I said, it was only about 50 yards over the road. He says, that's fine. He says, on that yard, did he says, will you work out 18 holes and put them on the scorecard and sign the scorecard, please? And that's, that was one of my experiences. And it was just a case of, he, wanted, he just wanted to say he had been on the golf course and hit a ball. <laughs> you know? And that's all he wanted, and then to go get some beers at the pub. Yeah. Yeah. And then and you've been doing this for how many years? Over 60 years. Over 60 years, and four British Opens. Yeah. Four British Opens, that's unbelievable. And you've been, since you were 16 years old, 14 years old? 13 years old. 13 years old. The first time when I carried it. Right here at St. Andrews. Yeah. That's unbelievable.